bulletin. I am Vidhi Satsaji. And I am Anja Sahi. And the headlines for today are Fusa tournament concluded. Google Translate Community Training held. The donation program successfully conducted. Nepal gives the new constitution. Board exam of Class 2018 started. Now, news in brief. Movie Club has sold South Bar as part of their regular show. Mid term of Bats 2016 and 2017 has started from 2nd of October. Now, news in detail. On 22nd September, Diawak Institute of Technology co hosted a translator thorn at DWIT. There were two Google experts present to provide training to a total of 45 students. The program was a Google's invitation to participate in public awareness campaign, Love Your Language which introduces Nepal to a free online tool called Google Translate Community. It aims to improve the quality of representation, accuracy, and understanding of the Nepali language on the web through crowdsourcing community input. The program focused on introducing the students about crowdsourcing rather than training students. The program itself was first of its kind to be held at DWIT. Board examination of BATS 2018 started from 25th September amidst the chaos. Students are forced to wait for transportation from early in the morning due to the shortage of fuel as a result of border blockage by India. Social Service Club organized a blood donation program on 1st October 2015 at Work Complex. More than 60 people comprising of Work services, staffs and students donated their blood. This was really a great initiative taken by the DWIT Social Service Club. Congratulations to all. Nepal finally has a new constitution. It took almost a decade for the Constituent Assembly to come up with a new constitution. The new constitution was supposed to come six years ago. This historic event was celebrated with fireworks in different places of Kathmandu. People have a great hope with this new constitution. For the in-depth news, we have a news on DWIT Social Tournament. On 27th September, finals of Ursa tournament took place at Sky Goals, Bhatwadini Maharajganj. Nidhu Lady Sports Club successfully organized the Ursa tournament for both boys and girls. <laughs> Since the exam of 2018 has started, there were no girls present from the batch of 2018. As a result, there were only four members in the team Askio. From the boys' team, Pandas defeated Spartans to cleanse the victory. Similarly, from the girls' team, Sadi FC defeated the team Askio and took the girls' championship title. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. Keep updating yourself with the DWID News Bulletin. Namaste. Namaste.